you don't need to go abroad to do English speaking practice. You can do it at home by yourself with our best English stories. All you need to do is listen to a story in English. Then at the English speaking practice part, answer the easy questions out loud. Please listen to this lesson two times every day for a month so that you can use English vocabulary and sentences automatically. Hello and welcome to Learn English with Story. Today, we're going to practice English speaking with a thrilling story. First, you'll listen to the story, and then I'll ask you some easy questions about it. Try to answer these questions out loud to quickly improve your speaking skills. Ready? Let's get started. Story. Once upon a time, there was a man named Leo. Leo was traveling by train. He got off at the Greenfield station. Then he went to a town called Wild Greenfield. Everyone in the town seemed happy, so Leo decided to go to the saloon to join in the celebration. But as Leo entered the saloon, he saw a nervous man running towards him. The man told Leo that there had been a bank robbery. Leo felt very sad and angry. He wanted to find the robbers. Leo told the man, I want to find the robbers, but I can't do it alone. I need a strong and wise partner. The man replied, I know someone who can help. Come with me. They went to a shooting range where the man pointed to a blonde woman. He said, This is Jane. She never misses a shot. You can trust her. Leo was impressed and explained everything to Jane. Jane agreed to help Leo. They prepared their horses and set off. As they traveled, they saw the robbers crossing a rope bridge. When the robbers saw Leo and Jane, they cut the bridge. Leo and Jane had to find another way. They took a longer road and spent the night playing instruments by the campfire. The next day, they climbed the cliffs. Finally, they found the robbers and their hideout in a mine. Leo and Jane went inside the mine and followed the noise. They found the robbers preparing explosives. Leo and Jane caught the robbers and handed them over to the police. Everyone in the town was so happy. Questions and answers. Now I'll ask you some questions about the story. If you need extra time, pause the video, think about your answer, and then play it again. Let's get started. Was there a man in the story? Yes, there was a man. What was his name? His name was Leo. How was Leo traveling? He was traveling by train. Where did Leo get off the train? He got off the train at the Greenfield station. Did he go to East Town? No, he went to Wild Greenfield. How did everyone in Wild Greenfield seem? Everyone seemed happy. Where did Leo go to celebrate? He went to the saloon. Who ran towards Leo in the saloon? A nervous man ran towards him. What did the man tell Leo? He told Leo that there was a bank robbery. How did Leo feel about the robbery? He felt sad and angry. What did Leo want to do? He wanted to find the robbers. Did Leo think he could find the robbers alone? No, he needed a strong and wise partner. Who did the man introduce to Leo? The man introduced Jane to Leo. Did Jane agree to help Leo? Yes, she agreed. What did Leo and Jane do after Jane agreed to help? They prepared their horses and set off. Conclusion. Thank you for listening to this exciting story and practicing your English with us. Remember to listen to the lesson many times until you can answer the questions quickly and confidently. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to Learn English with Story Queen for more interesting stories and English practice. Happy learning!